Hi viewers, producing a movie is a task we all know that. And also that the producer invests in making a film and the distributor releases it of course. The process involved in producing a film and taking it to the theatres and lots of work takes place. As soon as the film is showcased on the silver screen, we get to know the performance of the movie in terms of share, grass, and net, and also break even, and many such terminologies that we hardly understand. Let's take a glance at the process of releasing a movie. Post production, a trailer of the movie is showcased, distributors take a call based on the trailer. Secondly, region wise, distributor takes the film from the producer to the theatres. Usually, the distributor then holds the theatre owners. There are two types of theatres, single screen theatres and multiplex. Depending on the weekly rents and the ABC categorization, the film collections are calculated here. The distributor pays the theatre owners. If the film does not match the expected collection, a negative share is also paid to them as the theatre owners have nothing to do with the film collections. At multiplex theatres, rents vary during the first, second and third weeks. The arrangement and agreement may be on percentage basis also as the maintenance of these multiplexes is far too exuberant. So, if the film does well and makes profits, the distributor would benefit but if the film fails to impress, the distributor is at a loss. At the box office, the ticket collection amount in the cinema theatres is called gross of that particular film. For instance, 1000 tickets are sold at a theatre and each ticket costs about Rs 100. The total collection of the day is 1000 tickets into 100 is a 1 lakh rupee. This amount is the gross collection of that particular movie. Net collection of the movie is the balance after the deduction of entertainment taxes from the gross amount. Entertainment tax is deducted as 20% at multiplex theatres and 18% at single screen theatres. So, on an average of 20% tax deducted from 1 lakh gross, the remaining is 80,000 to be the net collected as calculated. Net collection minus the theatre rent or the percentage share at the multiplex happens to be the share. For instance, 20,000 rupees calculated as theatre rent the remaining amount is 60,000 is the movie share given to the distributor. Break even, which means any movie will become a business before its release. The producer sells the movie to the distributors. Based on the expectation of the collection the movie makes, he buys it and the actual share gets out of the number of movies. If the share is over and above the amount that he purchased the movie for, the movie turns out to be a hit and earns profits to the distributor. Do we now know how a movie's revenue is calculated in terms of gross, net and share? In the next episode, we will understand how to define a movie as a hit, super hit, blockbuster, average or a disaster. For doubts, please comment below. For great content of the Tinsel Town and gossips, please do like, share and subscribe Million Minutes.